Alright, in this video we're just looking at the idea of a rejection region and a test stat and how to make an initial conclusion. So just a reminder of that basic principle of hypothesis testing. So in this particular problem we're assuming that the test is a right tail test and they tell us that the critical value for the procedure is 2.539 2.539. So remember, this is the critical value. This is the thing that's on the curve, and it comes from a table. So the critical value, remember, comes from the t table, right? Now compare that versus your test stat, your t test stat, the thing that comes from this formula. You know, that value, they tell us in the problem, is uh, 2.95. Now what you do with your test stat is you place it on the curve and you determine where it lands with regard to the critical value. So 2.95 is clearly larger than the critical value so it ends up landing over here in the right tail. Remember when you land in the shaded rejection region you decide that you reject HO and if you reject HO that means that you support HA. So if your claim is HA, you would say you support HA. If your claim is HO, you would say you reject HO. But this is your pair of initial conclusions.